can't believe I didn't get to go to Cabarete and interview Susie May by the pool. Yeah, whatever. Progression are back with some tips on handle passes and riding switch. Switch it up. In episode two, we started you off with the fundamentals of competition kite surfing. Unhooking, the Rayleigh, and the S-Bend. So the next steps are two areas which build on these earlier aspects and will bring a whole new dimension to your kite surfing. Handle passes. Once you start progressing, you'll try landing tricks to blind or rat. But ultimately, you're gonna to wanna to start passing the bar. Strength plays a part, but technique is just as important. Top tip, the bar into your hips. You should always be aiming to have the bar pulled in towards your front or back hip, ready to pass. In reality, it might not always get that close, but the focus should be in that direction. Switch. We all have a strong side for different tricks, but the real skill is relearning to do it the other way round. Way harder than it seems, but landing a trick switched is a big point scorer. Top tip, practice. Unfortunately, there isn't a quick fix for this, Every trick is different, but one thing is for sure, you need to persevere and try and try again. Getting someone to film you will help you see what you're doing wrong. Obviously, there is a multitude of ways in which you can take a simple Rayleigh or S-Bend, throw in some further rotations, grabs, and the all-important handle pass to keep you busy on the water. But even if you're still working on the basics, Try out a local competition and force yourself to try something new in your next session. If you want more in-depth analysis of these tricks, then check out the Progression Advanced and Professional DVDs or many of the free progression videos on our website.